Hi, it's Pam Slim with another Power Boost marketing tip, and I have Abe Cahuto in front of me. And Abe is a multi talented person. He does all kinds of things that have to do with creativity, but in particular, really works a lot with video and having small business owners get a lot more comfortable for using video, especially with their online uh, presence. Why is it so important these days? Every news article I'm reading is saying that video is taking everything over, and, and why is video so important in terms of establishing a connection with your market? It's kind of a natural progression in that people like to connect with other people, hmm. and one of the ways to do that, uh, besides blog posts, besides establishing social proof and all that stuff, is to show your face, to show what people can know, like, and trust about you, and I think video is really like the uh, great way of doing that. Yeah. So. So a lot of people get tripped out about technology, right? And may feel like they need a really fancy camera or things like that. Do you have any very specific tips about how people can just get started? You know, maybe they have a WordPress site, they have a blog, but they want to start to include small video clips. What are some ways to get kickstarted? A lot of small businesses think they have to have most, the most expensive gear or really, really technical stuff just to get started with video and a lot of times that paralyzes them but what a lot of people don't realize is they have a lot of these things already like whether it be a smartphone like the iPhone that shoots HD video or a MacBook that has a uh, iSight camera included and really pretty good editing software like you can get started right away so a lot of people have been just turning on their MacBooks on iMovie and just hitting record and that's a really good good way of going about it um, and using your iPhone to record in HD just look at the tools that you already have and just start start off start off slowly like start off with what you already have and build from there like it took me many many years to build my my kit so to speak in terms of like all the gear but it always is a progression like it's all about the content at the end of the day it's all about showing off where you are and if you get some good lighting, um, say with a MacBook, one of the one of the tips that that I always tell people is when they're looking at the MacBook screen, recording themselves, um, put up an empty Word document, like a white Word document. Mm -hmm. And if you put that up while you're recording, that acts as almost like a light. So because it's it's so bright, and so turn off your brightness, and that acts as like a key light, so that your face is really in the light, and you know you don't have any weird shadows, you don't look scary. So um, <laughs> that would be bad. Yeah, yeah, that's the thing that I see the most. It's like you know the Halloween flashlight to the face special. So um, open up an empty Word document, make the screen white, and just record. Use the tools that you already have, and you can make some great videos already and build from there. I love that. I am one of those people that uses the MacBook Pro, open up iMovie, shoot and record, and it took me a long time to start using video, but as soon as I started to do it, it got comfortable and easy and people really responded. So um, I appreciate that. Get started, make more of a personal connection with people, mm -hmm. and from what it sounds like, video is the place to go in the 21st century for marketing your business. It is. If you look at all the signs from all the media companies like Google and YouTube, and even things like Netflix or the way that HD TVs are made, it's all coming together around video and how video is distributed you know, to people, between businesses, between consumers. Um, it's all coming together, so it's a really good time to get into it. Awesome. Thanks, Abe. Thank you. <laughs>